going to show you five ways to use essential oils and these are the ways I take essential oils internally for health. It's Jeannie Bradley, your essential fairy godmother. Three really key reasons to use essential oils internally are one, our gastrointestinal health can really be benefited by the use of of essential oils internally. The second is we can improve healthy cellular function, which is amazing that essential oils can do that. And lastly is healthy immune. In fact, for me, taking essential oils internally is, it just works so fast and it's my favorite way of taking essential oils. And a side benefit from that is if, I, if I'm out in public and I don't wanna smell like essential oils, like I don't wanna smell like tea tree oil or something like that, I just take it internally and then that's it. You don't have the smell. So I'll show you how I do it. I love putting essential oils in my water bottle for two reasons. One, it gives me fresh breath all through the day as I'm drinking it. And number two, it helps freshen my water and it keeps my water bottle clean. It keeps it fresh through the whole day. So um, you wanna make sure that your water bottle is stainless steel or glass. Don't put it in plastic. But I love drinking Slim and Sassy. The good thing about it is when you put essential oils in a water bottle and then shake it up, it's dispersed. And then throughout the day, um, whenever I'm drinking out of my water bottle, I'll just shake it a little bit and then drink it. So that's just a really easy way. Good oils to put in here would be Slim and Sassy, Peppermint, Lemon. Lemon is super cleansing. And if I don't put Slim and Sassy in my water bottle, I really miss the peppermint taste. So even if I just wanna drink lemon that day, I usually add a little bit of peppermint because then it keeps my breath fresh all day. Number two is if I just want to drink some in my water, the way I do it is this. So when I go to restaurants and they have glass glasses, I usually put some lemon in my water and it's good for cleansing benefits and detoxing for my body, but it also keeps the water clean. So try to put your oil in your water first if you can and then you can't do that at restaurants usually. But then if you do that at home, when you fill up your water afterwards, then it helps mix up the essential oils in there so that they're not floating on the surface so much. So I really like doing that too. Number three is, let me show you how to use essential oils in a veggie cap. So these are doTERRA's veggie caps, so they're not made with animal products and they're not gelatin. Um, one of the number one ways, so if we're talking, so here's a veggie cap. And what we're gonna do is take the two parts apart. And there's a short part and a, and a tall part. And I'm gonna take the tall part. <laughs> there, I'm trying to make sure you can see this. And now, here, if we're talking about cell, healthy cellular function, I'm gonna show you how I use DDR Prime, which is for, um, it's the cellular complex to help with healthy cells. So here we go. The way you do it is you don't want to hold your bottle up above and hope that you get a drop in. Don't do that. To take the lip and just hold it over the edge and let's say I need two drops. I'm gonna go one, two. Whoops, and that's probably three. <laughs> but I can tell by how much is in there. Can you see that? Yeah. Okay. I can tell by about how much is in there. That's about three drops. And that went pretty fast. But here, so I'm gonna put the lid back on here. And I'm not gonna wait very long because this, since this is a veggie cap, a veggie cap will not last too long with essential oils in it. It will disintegrate. The other thing is for healthy immune. There is nothing that beats taking essential oils internally. I, nothing I found. And I've been using um, natural medicine for over 30 years. And I've not found anything that matches this. So what I do is, my favorite blend is 
oregano, on guard, and tea tree. Now, I have done it where I have to fill each one individually. Yes, you can do that. Or you can just take an empty bottle, of a essential oil bottle, that has something that you can take internally, like lemon or, or wild orange or on guard, and then fill up. And so this is what I do for the winter. I'll take like a third on guard, a third melaleuca, or tea tree, same thing, and a third uh, oregano. And, and fill up a bottle and leave it like that so that whenever I need extra help, I've already got it in one bottle. But for now, I'm gonna do this one more time. I'll just show you how you, you could take on guard by itself. So let's say I want two drops. One, two. So I just always put it on the edge like that. And usually two drops is plenty. If you need extra immune support, I take two drops of the others, those three I told you, oregano, tea tree, and on guard. I take two drops each about every four hours. So there you go. Extra immune support for me. Okay, number four. A really easy way to take essential oils internally is with a soft gel. And doTERRA has a lot of different essential oils that are in soft gels. For instance, this DDR Prime. DDR Prime comes in a soft gel. This is the tri ease blend, seasonal blend. That's about all I can say. But here's what the soft gel looks like. doTERRA also has copaiba soft gels, digest zen for tummy for your tummy, serenity for sleep support. Or if you don't wanna take the three immune, there's also an On Guard Plus, but the soft gels make it really easy to take that. Lastly is using it in food. So I got this out so I could remember. So here's my little travel kit that I carry my oils in. And I always carry ginger essential oil because I love ginger in my sushi dipping sauce, so I just put soy sauce in this in my little container here, and then put some of the ginger essential oil in there. And it's perfect because it gives me the, the taste of ginger, but not the heat. I, another way I like to eat essential oils for food is I put drops of lime in smoothies, and you can see my other video for that. I like essential oils in dips and things. There's just a really easy way to get a power pu punch, a power punch of, of flavor without a lot of work. So that's, that's, that's good for me. Anyway, so there's the five ways. In a water bottle where you can shake it up, just in your water, taking a, a drop of that in water, um, putting them in veggie caps and taking them internally that way, um, the soft gels, which are already made for us, or just in our food. So there you go. Five ways to use essential oils internally and get some really amazing benefits. I hope you liked this. I hope you got something out of it. Tell me below how you use essential oils internally and maybe which one of your favorite oils to take internally. Again, this is Ginny Bradley, your essential fairy godmother.